everyone welcome back to the channel in this video we are going to see love in the general for the sign of scorpio from now till the end of uh, september so watch this video if you're a scorpio or if you're dealing with one if you want to have a personal reading link is in the description if you want to follow my instagram the link is in the description so now let us see messages for the sign of scorpio from now till the end of september how are you doing i hope you guys are doing well and let's see what tarot has to say for you from now till the end of september all right so what is the blessing coming in for scorpio from now till the end of september what is the blessing coming in so the blessing that is coming in is the sun card which is actually a very positive card uh shows to me that there's gonna be a lot of optimism uh good times um spending time with your loved ones or just feeling very content and happy within your own self you know you're gonna feel very happy content and free basically so i see that there's gonna be a lot of optimism some of you if you are having any health concerns um then with the sun card i also see a lot of healing is going to come in and you are going to feel very better your vitality is going to increase basically okay and what can be a possible blockage for scorpio your blockage is the fool card okay so scorpio i see that something that you need to be really careful is that first of all you need to take um into consideration that you have a lot of options right so if you are trying to start something new universe is going to give you a lot of opportunities and you need to make use of them so that is something uh and for that you need to be willing to take uh the risks all right so this is something that um you need to do but uh what you need to uh pay attention is that you're not rushing into things with half knowledge or you're not trying to impulsively do something i see that you might be overly excited to get something started and then you will do it um in impulses and um, then you will just um, you know like land into problem or you will not be able to complete so your message is that if you are trying to start something new or if you're trying to indulge in something you you have uh, done your research for it and only then you are jumping into it you're not jumping into things uh, with half knowledge basically so this is something that you need to be careful of and again you need to take some risks as what i see yeah see two of sword exactly what i was saying so i see that there can be a situation where you may feel confused um and you may feel stagnant um so you need to remove all these confusions uh by digging deep and finding information and um trying to research basically if you're trying to start something just make sure that you're doing proper research and also do not stay stuck do not be in a victim mindset like sometimes um we we can see that things are not moving and you know like um the situation is not happening and then uh, we just keep on ignoring it so your message is that if there is any problem if you know that a particular area of your life is stagnant you need to first acknowledge that okay uh, there is a problem and i accept it and now what can i do to fix it I instead of telling yourself or convincing yourself that no there is no problem everything is fine i don't see any problem so don't do that right so if you uh, want to move ahead uh, you need to bring in that clarity and you need to acknowledge um of the problems that are existing so that is that now let's see your career scorpio from now till the end of september so what is the present energy for scorpio in career wow three of cups so i see that in your career uh, right now you might be um, you know working in groups and teams there can be people around you who want to help you support you so this is a great time to uh, mingle with people socialize with people because uh, they may help you if you're looking for an opportunity then you know asking your friends or people around you is a very good option so i i definitely see that there will be people around you who are going to help you in your career and this is a great time to build network circle and like socialize and like you know um connect with people basically some of you there can also be some sort of a celebration happening um at your workspace so that is possible what can be a possible blockage for scorpio in career your blockage is 3 of pentacle wow <laughs> so i see that this is something that you need to do you need to connect with people you need to socialize and everything and your blockage could be that you will have a hard time doing it now this can be because of various reasons maybe you feel like um you know your interests do not match or you just feel like uh people around you don't understand you or whatever so i see that something that you need to um take care of and work right now is to build teamwork uh, the more you can work in team it will be good for you do not try to do things alone and do not try to um just think about yourself 
but try to think about uh, the collective the more you think about others around you as well the more success is going to come towards you the more you try to be selfish um, the more harm it's going to cause you all right so this is something that you need to really pay attention to i also see that some of you um, you will be um, doing something and then um, you will be very much focused on the rewards so your message is to not focus on the reward try to focus on the teamwork focus on your effort focus on the quality of the work and if you will do it the rewards are going to come in right so just pay attention to that and then what is the outcome for scorpio in career your outcome is the two of one so i see growth i see expansion i definitely see that you know there is something that you might be planning right now and you will be taking that next step so with careful planning and contemplation you can move to the next level in your career you can move to the next stage if you want to start something i see that with careful planning i remember i was telling you to plan properly and only then get started so i see that if you invest that time in planning and everything you will be able to move to the next level and you will be able to create whatever you're trying to create so that is something some of you may also see some sort of a good news or like a news is going to come to you from like a distant place now this can be email this can be a call this can be a message whatever and i see some sort of a good news coming in like from a distant place which is going to be with respect to your career and it's going to be for your growth so i see that and also i see universe um, high time wants you to get out of your comfort zone and take some risks now this is not the time to play safe this is the time to take some calculated risks um scorpio so this is something that you need to keep in mind now let's see your love life scorpio what's happening in scorpio's love life um let's see that give me the present for scorpio in love so i see we have five of pentacles scorpio do you feel sidelined by somebody you might be feeling this energy of abandonment maybe you were dealing with an earth sign taurus virgo capricorn doesn't really matter but i see that some of you you feel like somebody abandoned you or maybe you abandoned someone um there's this energy of not feeling happy and content and you you might be feeling like your um needs are not met um in relationship or some of you if you are single i just see that you're not happy with being single and you feel like at times you feel very alone and um you feel very sidelined you feel very uh, abandoned so i see that right now you're not able to see any hope when it comes to your love life what is the blockage for scorpio in love your blockage is a nine of swords so scorpio i see that your blockage is that somewhere uh, you are beating yourself up too much for the mistakes that you might have um, made knowingly or unknowingly i don't know what happened but i see, you know you just see one thing if you see about both the cards she's hiding her face so here also she's hiding her face and here also she's hiding her face so this is this energy of guilt you know this is the energy of beating your own self um feeling embarrassed of yourself and your mistakes or whatever so i see that you might have committed some mistakes or you've had some sort of a challenges in the past and now you're very embarrassed about it and you kind of beat yourself up you're like i did that i should not have done this i should have reacted like this so a lot of should have could have would have are happening in your life and um you're not able to accept and come to the terms with the fact that whatever happened happened and now i need to move forward i cannot stay stuck you know so this is what i was telling you know you the, the message is resonating that if you feel that you are stuck in a particular situation and something is not working accept that it's not working and then accept that you need to make a shift instead of um, convincing yourself that there is no problem so this is what it is i see that there is some sort of a pain hurt disappointment and uh, you're beating yourself up for that and you're not able to process it what is the um, outcome for scorpio in love so your outcome is the queen of cups and bottom of the deck is death card so i see there's a major transformation happening in your love life something might definitely be coming to an end so some of you a relationship is coming to an end or maybe a chapter in your life is coming to an end so a major transformation is happening but the queen of cups here is telling me that you know you are going to um be very secretive and i see that in the from now till the end of september you're going to keep your emotions to yourself like you will not be very expressive and you will be trying to hide your feelings and your emotions and this will kind of uh, make it difficult for you to connect with people you know so this is something that you need to work upon and you need to fix this uh, if you want to grow right so you cannot stay stuck and you cannot keep on um, hiding your feelings and emotions you need to be more um, expressive is what i see 
and i also see that something major is like coming to an end a relationship or maybe you know like some sort of a toxic past chapter was not working in your life and now finally it is coming to an end and um, it's going to be for your greater good eventually but you need to make pace with it so that is what it is and i see that this situation is somewhere going to make you a person who is not very expressive anymore and you will start hiding your feelings and emotions and you will start being very secretive so this is something that you need to work upon that you don't become that person you need to be expressive you need to be open you need to be welcoming don't hide yourself okay just because something did not work in the past doesn't mean that your life is going to be like that forever you need to understand that what is the advice for scorpio please what is the advice for scorpio your advice is the tower card so yeah like first of all if something is coming to an end if a chapter by the way we also have the ace of cups just beneath that so yeah your advice scorpio do not let your ego get in the way i see that universe is trying to bring in a shift in your life a major transformation in your life but your ego keeps coming in the way and you're not able to accept an ending and a new beginning somewhere you're trying to hold very strongly to a past situation which you clearly know is not working you know it's not working you know that you need to release it but you keep on holding on to it and then universe is asking you to clear all the things that are not working for you if you know that something is toxic it's not working for you it's time that you release it instead of beating yourself up for that and i also see that egoistically you need to release something like your ego is not releasing but you need to do it now all right and then if you will do i see that you will be able to connect with somebody um much more meaningful and somebody with whom you will be emotionally connecting on a deeper level but for that you need to let go of this toxic ending this very tough chapter in your life which happened some of you i definitely see that you had a major major ending and it's paining a lot you are not able to accept it but you need to let it go and if you will do it a new beginning is going to happen in your life but right now is the time for you to heal and just process this ending okay all right give me the oracle message for scorpio please free yourself yeah the exact thing that i was telling you know so i see that you need to free yourself you need to take time and you need to take control of your life back in your life stop feeling um sorry for yourself stop uh, playing the victim card stop feeling pity on yourself just you need to take back control of your life and you need to understand that whatever happened happened now i cannot keep on beating myself i need to move forward and i need to process these this ending only then i will be able to move on to something new so you need to accept it okay so this is pretty much your reading i hope this helps and resonate if it does make sure you subscribe like share comment i will see you very soon in the next video till then you guys take care stay safe bye